welcome to another tutorial in my advent series and um, this is a style that for those of you who think that I am obsessed with rope braids and Chinese buns it proves you right because what we're going to do is the roped Chinese bun which is a variation on the braided Chinese bun that was my very first tutorial um, so what you have to do for this one is um, divide your hair into two down the middle and make sure that your two bunches are close together um, and then you're going to rope braid each of those two bunches I've already um, done this one just to save time so I'm going to do the other um, you're going to need hair elastics you're going to need a hair stick and um, a you may also want hair grips um, if if you need them to secure the style um, okay so I'm going to rope braid this other half and what I'm going to do to make sure that it doesn't sort of go wandering off um, towards this side of my head when it needs to be going this way is that as I braid it I'm going to be pulling it this way so uh, that should keep it going in the direction I want it to go in Okay, so that's ensuring that the uh, the braid is going in the right direction. I'm just going to continue the braid down and tie it off. Okay, so you've now got two rope braids at the back of your head, pretty close together. Now you're going to grab your hair stick and slide it just above where those top hair elastics are that are keeping your bunches in place. Just do it like that. Take your rope braids, and this is the same as. Uh, the braided Chinese bun we did so many months ago. Cross them under, cross them over, cross them under, cross them over, tuck the ends in and just use a hair grip to pin it in place. That's what it looks like. That is a roped Chinese bun. I hope you've enjoyed the tutorial and I will see you again tomorrow. Cheerio.